Good morning to Dr. Hanisa Binti Abdurraza. Today, I'm Brian Duwinko. We'll present the introduction of our group assignment at our company. So, the first one is, what is management? The management is, is uh, the management is at a uh, vulnerable force. Uh, under pressure on achieve a goal and end up with the triple power of constraint operating on objective and subjective interpersonal imitation and imagination institutional and environmental levels uh, in other words means that the management is the process of planning organizing leading and controlling to achieve the company's goals effect effectively and efficiency so what, got, what is organization organization is a body that arranged by a group of people to achieve the goals that they're targeted so our group our groups this uh, decide that our company name is seven shoot private limited and this is our logo of our company and our location is stated at Kawasan by Industrial Chemelang at 1800 Ulu Johor. So, uh, thanks, uh, thanks, thank you for doctor to listening my presentation about the introduction. Next, I will invite my uh, one of my members, members of our groups. Mm, his name is Izudin. We will present about our business background. We upon you and such an amazing day to Dr. Hanisa Binti Abdul Raza and all my friends. My name is Muhammad Izuddin bin Abdul Raza. My metric number is 279467. I'm from group 13. Let's get start our presentation today with background company. First, name of our company is Seven Shoe Private Limited. Our company is led by Brian Q. Wing Kong as Chief Executive Officer. We have one general manager and five managers. Our company is located at Kawasan Perindustrian Cemerlang, 81800 Ulu Tiram, Johor. Type of business of our company is partnership. Partnership is an arrangement between two or more than two persons like Brian and his friends to manage business operations and share its profits and liabilities. In general, partnership company is all members are sharing both profit or loss and liabilities within themselves. Mission and vision of our company. Mission of our company is we provide the good quality of sports shoes and services to satisfy our customer based on customer needs and wants to get the loyalty customer for every sports shoes that we had produced and build a strong relationship with our customer. Vision of our company is we want to be an eminent organization in the world that focusing the quality of sports shoes before marketed to the that product to the customers and be able to compete with other sports shoe companies in the global market. Objective of our company first to ensure our products can be compete with big firm sports shoes product. Second, to ensure continuous return on income and have strong position in the big industry for the long term. Third, produce quality sports shoes products and ensure our customer satisfied with our product. The last one is expanding our sports shoes products to the global market. Thank you. Good morning, doctor and everyone. My name is Tanyan Cho and my matrix number is 279410. Today, I want to present the management function. The management functions have four basic. They are planning, organizing, leading and controlling. This function work together in the questions, executions and realizations of organizational goal. What is planning? Planning has the effect of setting the goals of business or organizations and deciding how to achieve them. 
Planning is the process of thinking about and organizing the activity required to achieve a desired goal. There are, four, there are five steps in the planning. The step one is establish the mission, visions, and values. The missions of our company, we are uh, we provide a good quality of sports shoes and service to safety customer based on customer needs and wants. The visions of our company are we want to be an eminent organization in the world that focusing the quality of sports shoes before market that product to the customer and be able to compete with other sports shoes company in the world level. The step two are uh, assess the current clarity. The strength of our company is the products are lower price between the other products in the market. For weaknesses of our company is lack of high technology infrastructure. The high technology infrastructure is the significant aid to improve the product produce in the manufacturer. After that, corporate image and brand equity is the opportunity of our company. The brand equity, such as the comp as the customer can more trust and confident to the products. For term that are many competitors with the great brands such as Nike and Adidas. The step three are formulate the great strategy, strategy, tactical and operational plan. Strategy plans of our company are we plan the long-term goals as ensure our sports shoot products can compete with the brand fit sports shoot product. Second is ensure continuous returns on income and have strong position in the big industry of big long term. Third is produce quality sports shoot products. The tactical plans of our company is the financial department plan a short goal to achieve the sales in cross our up to 20% compared with the past year. The sales and marketing department are improve our products and service with the promotion plan to increase sales. The operational plans are the first line manager will do the operation planning based on the tactical planning. After that, the step four are in, improvement the strategy. Improvement the strategy is putting strategy plans into effect. That means control system are available to execute the plan. The step five are maintain strategy control. The manager and employee or say should stay focused on the important things to know and fight by other things. The manager also have to keep moving toward the visions of the future. Thank you. Hi and Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. My name is Siti Nur Izati Binti Fauzi, metric number 279576. I am from group 13. Now I want to talk about organizing. Introduction to organizing. Organizing defined as arrangement tasks, people and other resources to accomplish the part of work. Process of identifying and grouping of the works by delegating tasks to the right people to be performed and also can establish relationship for the purpose of enabling people to work more efficiently. Productivity of company can increase when led by person who had experience and responsibility. In addition, it is also can increase the efficiency of labor. Benefits of organizing 
First, the whole world systematically allocate and divide into different parts. It will increase efficiency of workers and also can motivate them to put their best into the work. Second, to clarify in working relationship. The establishment of working relationship clarifies line of communication between managers with workers and also specifies who is report to who. Three, to provide a clear description of jobs and related duties. In order to ensure smooth functioning in company, organizing suitable modified the organizational structure and various interrelationship existing. Organizational structure. The system that outlines how certain activities are directed in order to achieve the goals of organization is called an organizational structure. Allows to remain efficient and focus whenever it grows in size or complexity. We choose the metric organizational structure for our company, which is 7 Shoe PTE Ltd. This organizational structure is a combination of two or more types of organizational structure which include functional organization structure and projective organization structure. One of the biggest advantage of using the metric organizational structure is that it is allows to sharing of highly skilled resources between functional unit and project. Metric Organizational Structure of 7 Shoes PTLTD Grouping Job into Function First, Finance Department Control Inflow and Outflow Money in Company Responsible for Acquiring Funds From the Firm, Managing Funds Within the Organization and Planning for the Expenditure of Funds on the Various Assets to provide insightful information in long-term and short-term decision-making. Sales and Marketing Department to develop various marketing strategies to improve our product and service in 7 Shoes PTLTD include generating unique sales plan, creating engaging advertisement and promotional literature and developing pricing strategy to help boost our company to get profit and sales on our product and service that has been provided. Operation Department managing the operation and process within an organization. More accountability and accuracy for successful delivery of a product or service in our company with effective operation management. Manufacturing Department Primarily responsible for implementing and operating the op production system in order to produce the product. Include of the thing like purchase, distribution and installation as well as the physical manufacture of the component which will be issued by our company. Company need the good technician and associate professional to produce the best product among consumer. Research and Development Department, they need to achieve future growth and maintain relevance in the chosen market. Involved in spending resources on investigation and testing to develop new product or new ways to make our product with high quality. It can enhance existing product or process in doing the product. Thank you. A very good morning, good afternoon, or good evening to Doctor. My name is Tanima, metric number 279571. Now I'd like to present about the third or the fourth function in the management process, which is leading. Leading is described as motivating, directing, and otherwise influencing people to work hard and also is the process of a leader to influence behavior and attitude of other people to achieve the organization goal. The first way to leading is listen to the team. Leader must always listen to his teammate's suggestion. Communication in a team is very important as it can help leader communicate well with his teammate to about their tasks. Leader easily ignore his teammate as they have important tasks on, on their own duty. It may cause leader to not get what his teammate really want to. The second way to leading is deliver the promised result. Leader must try their best as they can to achieve the result as promises. For example, they can double check the work when the work was done by his teammate according to the standard they have already set. The third way to leading is resolve conflict quickly. 
conflict will happen within leader versus leader, employee versus employee, or leader versus employee. Leader must solve the conflict quickly to avoid other people, spread the conflict to other people. This action will decrease the another problem in the company. The importance of leading is to let employees know that whatever their boss is the person who pays the salary, but their boss are not just seek to receive the result. They also work hard together with them to achieve the result. Seven Shoe Company have five departments, which is finance department, sales and marketing department, operation department, manufacturing department, and the last one is research and development department. For finance department, the function of leading is financial manager will adopt the technology to improve the efficiency and effectively in the organization. They will prepare the UBS system as a head to control the inflow and outflow money, which is handled by his teammate. For sales and marketing department, leader will give the thought to his teammate to let them know how to set the situation in customer mind, how to let customer straight to buy the product and not think first then buy. Communication between staff and customer is very important because it can change customer mind when customer has set the rule that you are a responsibility person. For operation department, leader must ensure that his teammates are not understanding the business overall goal and objective. They also are using the information which is provided by another department to run the business successful. Leader maintain the productive team to grow up a product or service. It can help organization gain advantage over their competition. For manufacturing department, leader must make sure that his teammate know how to use the machine to produce the company product with higher quality as per research and development department information. Leader must know how to discuss with his teammate to minimize the cost of material with higher quality. It can help company get the net profit in the future. For research and development department, leader must work hard together with his teammate to do the research to social media, for example, Facebook or Instagram. It can find out what people famous nowadays and people want to have it but hard to get it. And pass the information to manufacturing department to produce the new product based on their creativity and innovative. Thank you. Hey to Dr. Hanisa and all my friends. My name is Tay Cha Jo from Group 13, matrix number 279509. Today, I'm going to present about the controlling function in our seven shoe organization. The definition of controlling is a function which helps in measuring the progress towards the organization goals, bring any deviation and indicates corrective action. There are four steps in the process of controlling and the first one is establishment of standard. Standard are the targets of plan that need to be accomplished within the organization and also is the basis for performance evolution. Secondly, the step is measure actual performance. By measuring actual performance, we can easily find out the error in Siren Shoe. The actual performance that we can measure is the sales growth by gathering and reporting the sales data of our product which is Shoe. Besides, we can also evaluate the manager performance and the employee ability in their works. The third step is comparison of actual and standard performance. This step in controlling is very important because we are about to compare the actual operation within the standard of performance. We can know whether our organization performance achieve our goals or not, or even fail when we look at the system report. System report will be showing out the differences between our real performance within the standard performance that we had said before. And the last step is initiate corrective action. After we compare the actual and standard performance, we will know what is the problem that caused our organization cannot uh, achieve our goals. Therefore, we will be initiate corrective measures in order to achieve our organization goals. In Siren Shu, we have implemented the controlling function in five different departments. First of all, we have implemented the control in financial department. The financial control will be helping to controlling the financial flow such as to ensure the cash flow. In addition, it also helps to monitor the current assets and fixed assets that need to be used in our purchase and manufacture for the shoe. Um, 
Next, the balance sheet and income statement will be also prepared too to see whether the financial controlling is effective or not. The next one is sales and marketing department. In this department, we have also used the control function to monitor the performance level of the sales team from time to time. Besides, we also have a database control that keeps a track of who has access to the organization data and who does not to protect our confidential of seven shoe. And uh, furthermore, we have also used feedback control that give insights into customer needs to evaluate their opinion on our shoe products and services of seven shoes so that we can improve more. The third one is operation department. In operation department, we use operation control to ensure our daily tasks are aligned with our established goals and also strategy. Besides, we also control daily operation in regards to plan, product requirements and appendictures such as the skill of output or choices of equipment uh, in our seven shoe product. Moreover, we had also used the controlling function in our manufacturing department. In our department, uh, we use manufacturing control to ensure the quantity of shoe produced is being monitored and the working process is also observed at the predetermined process of production in order to determine that um, our shoe is in the correct quantity of the requirement quality work is also processed accordingly. And the next one, our quality and quantity of raw material and shoes production process that do not pass in each stage of inspection are also being observed and the replacement uh, are subject to control. Lastly, our uh, last department is research and development department. In this department, our organization use research and development control. Effectiveness control checks are carried out by analysis such as comment and monitoring of the shoe complaints and qualified material corrective and preventive action program are being carried out. This is the end of my presentation for our seven shoe company. Now I will pass to the next presenter. Thank you. Assalamualaikum and hi. My name is Muhammad Fitri Asnawi Beroslan. We'll be talk about conclusion function of management. Management is a creative problem solving that accomplished taught by applying four functions of management, which is planning, organizing, leading, and controlling. The intended result is the use of organization resources in ways that accomplish its mission and objective. It is clear that we organization are strongly influenced by theories introduced by Hendrik Fayel, Patrick W. Taylor, Max Weber, and Ethan Mayo. Their principles have become a strong momentum to our company as an example to follow for being a good and expert to big market organization. That's all from us. But before we end the presentation, we wanted to say you guys to follow the SOP, stay home, stay safe, kita jaga kita. Thank you.